Oh look, it's a figure I bought specifically to review on Halloween. Guess when this review's going up? From the Mattel WWE Zombies line, this is Stone Cold Steve Austin. And I just want to say this right now, right? I used to love when Mattel would do these gimmick lines. They did two waves of zombie wrestlers. They did the mutants, that's where you get Broctopus and Super Cena. Um, they did the Ghostbusters, they did the Ninja Turtles. I miss these a lot because I think they're so much fun. Um, I especially would love for there to be a return to the zombie figures just because, you know, I think they're cool. But let's actually take a look at this guy because when you get down to it, for a figure that was still made for kids, this is kind of a ghastly looking dude. Taking a look at this figure, and it is using the basic articulation, so ball joint at the head, universal at the shoulder, upper arm rotation, single jointed elbow, universal at the wrist, swivel at the waist, basic back and forth at the thigh, single jointed knee, and a little bit of a boot swivel. So not the most articulated guy, but just look at this. It's so fucking cool. I mean, take a look at this, right? The smoking skull. So what is, what does zombie Stone Cold have? Is a smoking skull. It would have been really cool if maybe the jaw could articulate, but quite frankly, I think this is interesting enough. And you have like all these exposed tendons around the neck from where the skin had been ripped off. You look down here at his abdomen, and you can see that he's just been run completely through. If you took the vest off, you can see like the spinal column back there. Let me see if I can get a better light on that. Can I kind of show it? Can I kind of show it? Can I kind of show it? No, I'd have to take the vest off. The vest, I don't want to take off because it's a very stiff material and I'm worried about getting it back on. Because, look at this on his hand, he has one finger left, and yeah, it would have been cool if it was the middle finger. But look at this, it's actually kind of funny, they took the middle finger away! They literally stripped Stone Cold of his middle finger. Oh, dude, I'm sorry, this is just... It's everything I love about toys rolled into a figure, man. It's stupid, it's dumb, and yet it's still really well sculpted and painted and it articulates well enough, and it's fucking Stone Cold Steve Austin. This is great. This is class. This is prestige. Keep your hot toys. Keep your Haya. Keep all your collector's figures. This is what I want. No joke, I think I need to start tracking down this line more.